everyone dreams of going to land of maple leaf right now that we call it canada <laughs> and when i interact with them they have the one motive we'll go there we will earn in dollars and send back and build adopt one of the village build roads then i see soldiers farmers social activists teachers who are working at grassroots level which route should i take oh. <laughs> I am not saying you should not go abroad. If you think you are going to learn something better there, acquire some more skills, then you can gather here. If there are possibilities or even if you are going to work there, but don't think in terms of you'll earn dollars, then come back and build your village. That's a long shot. Actually, what we need in this country is not necessarily dollars. What we need in this country is uh, a corruption-free, clear, focused and dedicated people. That's what we're missing. <laughs> money is there. We don't really need money from outside, really. It is just that we are constantly busy working against each other at so many levels, <laughs> okay? Our energies are simply spent throwing things at each other all the time. If you don't understand what I'm saying, just turn on one of the English news channels and watch in the evening. How much energy is simply wasted, simply saying rubbish against each other endlessly. <laughs> so this is going on, immense waste of energy, no cleanliness. When I say no cleanliness, hmm, I mean a whole lot of people are simply innocent of integrity. They're not corrupt, they're just innocent of integrity, they don't know what it is. So this process of what shall I do, should I go there and send dollars, if you are going there to pursue something, it is fine. If you think there is some form of uh, skill or education or knowledge or even a profession which is not available here, you want to go there, it is fine. But you are going there to make dollars and send it back, please don't waste your life like that. There is so much to be done here. If you have integrity, <laughs> why I'm focusing on integrity is this has been a scarce thing. So, whether it is politics or any profession, including spirituality, Unfortunately, one ingredient that is really weak in India right now is integrity. If you think you have integrity, please stay in India. We don't want one more to escape. I <laughs>